My character in Incredibles 2 is named Winston Dever, and he might come across to you as a, a bad person. <laughs> he's, a, he's a mogul, a media mogul, and he wants to work with the uh, Incredibles and the superheroes to have them kind of come out from uh, hiding because he loves superheroes. He genuinely loves them. Of course, you can't really tell if he's just trying to make money off them or exploit them in some way. But then you have to watch the whole story to figure out what's really going on. Uh, but as we meet him, he's very, he's, he's very gung-ho and he's a real salesman uh, in trying to convince the superheroes to come out from the shadows and, and do their jobs in society. When Elastigirl is invited to be the poster superhero for this new venture, well, it kind of hurts uh, Mr. Incredible's feelings because he'd like to be the leader. But he is also, they're a team, right? Just like a good family is a team, a good couple is a team. And uh, he takes over at home. And we get to see a dad trying to sort of find his way to you know, being a good dad and juggling all the home duties, that can be very hard to juggle, but that a lot of dads do juggle in modern American society, including me. I was good at that, I think. The scenes with the dad and the baby are just the most outstanding scenes in the movie. They make you smile. They'll make you, they'll bring you back to life. Brad Bird directed this movie and he is a massively talented person whose brain is big enough for five people. I don't know how he manages a story with this many components and that goes this many places and, and this funny and fun and human. Um, I mean, he's done some great films and this is just one more of them. He really orchestrates every aspect of your performance and in a good way, in an enjoyable way. But I mean, he, he could really like give me a little turn even on a word. Um, and sometimes when we would record, we would split things up almost to every sentence to try to, you know, give it the spin or the feeling that he wants it to have. So he's really the mastermind of this, uh, more than the screen slaver, he's the mastermind of Incredibles 2. Here's what you gotta look forward to in Incredibles 2, a really good time. Just lots of fun, sweet moments, comedy surprise around every corner, a complex story that keeps growing and, uh, and surprising you and, and, and bringing new elements into their world and, uh, and just a lot of great feeling.